What is up guys? We are finally back for the second half of this Brilliant Stars booster box opening. If you watched my first video, you saw the awesome pulls I had. And if you didn't, go watch that first video because I pulled some amazing cards from that one. So let's get right into it. We're going to go ahead and crack right into this Charizard pack. We're just going to go ahead and hit this one first. See if we can get first pack magic. Maybe we can pull a Charizard. Any of the Charizards, honestly. I would be happy with any Charizard pull. Even if I pulled the same Charizard four times, I'd be stoked. I just want... Ooh, Fire Energy. Right. So we got a Marnie's Pride, Pachirisu, Blunder Policy, Starly, Milkery, Carablast, Clefairy, Cherubi, Starmy Reverse, and a Grim Snarl. And also, before I forget, there was a Pokemon that I pulled in the last one. I'm going to pull it out here. I could not pronounce the name of it. Escavalier. I looked it up for you guys because I felt really dumb. Escavalier. So if I pull him again, not getting it wrong. Not getting it wrong next time, that's for sure. Oh, man, the dude. Badoop is the man, honestly. No water energy. Magma Basin. Crawdont. Collapse Stadium. Badoof. Badoof probably collapsed the stadium. Halucha. Bweasel. Gibble. Flygon Reverse Rare, that's cool. And a Professor's Research Holographic. I got one of those, so I'm just going to leave that one off to the side. Don't want to take too much time sleeving cards that I already pulled. Alright. We got a Metal Energy. We got Starmie. Pulled a bunch of those guys. Sigalith. Spiritomb. Burmy. Impidimp. Staryu. Leolu. Execute. Reverse. And a Heat Rain. Not holographic. Alright. Cool legendary from Legends Arc. I mean, he's not from Legends Arceus, but a cool one that you can acquire in Legends Arceus. Um, the fight for him was honestly really weird for me at first. It took me a minute to figure it out, but they they added a lot of cool aspects in that game. They made a lot of the bosses very different to fight, so. It wasn't just the same thing over and over again. The, you had to learn different aspects of the game to actually be successful. And I really liked that about it. Mewtwo! <laughs> you know? Well, okay, I'm sorry. I know this is a non-holographic. This is not a special card. But this is the first time that I have pulled a Mewtwo since I opened up the old Wizards of the Coast sets a long time ago when I was a kid. So this, this bad boy is getting sleeved up. I'm going to put a hard sleeve on him and he is going somewhere special on my shelf because I love Mewtwo. And like I said, it's the first Mewtwo I've pulled since. So that one, honestly, is going to have a lot, a lot of sentimental value to me. Let's see. Let's see what else we can get. Leaf Energy. Pachirisu. Ultra Ball, hit on top. Shinx, Farfetch'd, Execute, Grimer, Clefairy, Reverse Cafe Master, and a Wormadam, not holographic. Nothing so far for this, this half of the box. The Professor's Research Hollow, and then my boy Mewtwo over here. But as far as actual good pulls go, running pretty dry on this one so far. So let's see if we can pick it up here. All right, we got the V-Star card. Last time I pulled a V-Star card out of a pack, I pulled a really good card. So it'll be three, I think. All right, hopefully I didn't do that wrong. Should've just left it in the thing, but whatever. Oh, and I did, it's an Entei V. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys, but hey, we got a good pull, so I'll just quickly show you 
the rest of the cards from that pack. And we'll go ahead and sleep this guy up. I'll take that though, Entei V. Hell yeah. Awesome first, uh, first pull. A big pull to have for this half of the box. Just wait for that Charizard. Give me a Charizard. Give me a Charizard. Next pack art after this is Charizard, so I got a good feeling about that one. Cynthia's Ambition pulled that full art. Shreen's Care, Kindler, Baltoy, Snow Rump, Nose Pass, the Dene, Cub Chew, Starly, and Lumidin. Another one of those guys. See, I see Charizard. So I normally pronounce the names of the Pokemon pretty good. I don't know why I stumbled on that one so hard. But like I said, I apologize for that. Hopefully you guys don't unsubscribe from me now because that'd be a bummer. Honestly, I just want to keep doing this. Even if I don't, I don't expect my channel to, to take off or anything. Honestly, I just started doing this because I'm already opened in the Pokemon card, so I might as well do something fun out of it, right? I mean, this is a blast, honestly. Truby Reverse. And you hear Bernay Paul Graphic. But, honestly, I, I, I used to collect Pokemon cards as a kid a lot, and I started collecting them as soon as Base Set came out in the United States, and I collected Pokemon cards probably until about 2002, so I didn't, I didn't have the privilege of collecting all of this, these Wizard of the Coast sets, and I missed a lot of, like, black and white, and pretty much the releases of all the Sun and Moon sets. I missed all of that because I just wasn't really in the scene anymore, and then I finally got back into it, and I got a set. Oh, no. I was in a sentimental moment here, Shaman, talking about my feelings, and you had to go and surprise me with your awesome pull. You know what? It's cool. You can interrupt me anytime, Shaman D Star. I'll take you that all day long. Nice, beautiful card. All right, put that guy here. And to be completely honest, I lost track of everything I was talking. About. You know what? No. So I missed the Sun and Moon sets, and I recently got back into it for the release of. Oh, I can't even think of the set right now. Um, what was it? I want to say it was maybe Battlestar, I can't remember, but I got into it not that long ago, and I've just been trying to collect cards, just get some sets, get some get some sealed boxes, and just open them on the channel, because it's just a blast, but honestly, if I'm, I'm just going to keep doing this as long as I keep collecting Pokemon cards, because... This is just an awesome time, and editing the, editing the videos is fun. The whole just the whole process of this doing these YouTube videos is so much fun. And honestly, I, I it would be awesome if I got more subscribers and I got more for people to watch because I have some cool stuff to open. I I got a Unified Minds box on eBay the other day, but I, I gotta wait. I'm waiting to open it because. It's, it's got to be something special for the channel. Remember, Dan? And I want to make sure that when I open that box, it gets it gets plenty of views so people can see all the awesome cards from that set. Because that is a killer set. I got I got I got a few booster boxes here sealed. Um, I'm kind of hoping to keep some of them sealed because I've never been able to keep product sealed like Pokemon cards. I've always just been wanting to open them, but I got a few on my shelf here, and just looking at them sealed, it's just such a nice thing to see. Nose pass. Snow Runt. Clint. Dedene. <laughs> Luminion V. All right. I'll take it. Nothing crazy, but it's a hit. Let's see, we still got six packs to open up here. Give me a Charizard, baby. I will be opening up 
more of this set, especially since I haven't even pulled a Charizard yet. My goal is to pull all of them. So, hopefully we can get lucky and do that eventually. So we got a Leaf Energy, Choice Belt, Starvia, Floatzel, Burmy, Impidimp, Staryu, Riolu, Starly, Reverse Morgrum, and a Star Raptor not hologram. Crafting this next pack here. So so far the first half of the box was a little better than this is so far, but we got we got more packs to pull, so let's hope we get something good. Got a lightning energy. Berry, Clay, Gabite, Shinx, Impidimp, Golette, Castform, Chimchar, a Reverse Sock, and a Boss's Orders Holograph. I already pulled that one, so I'm not going to worry about sleeving that guy up. Get me this Shaman Pack here. That one just opened like butter. See the code cards are different. To be honest, I don't know which one means which, but I try not to pay attention to what the code card is because I like it to be a surprise. Got an executor. Duskull, Sneasel, Corfish, Magmar, Spear Tomb, and a full art Houndoom single strike. That's what I'm talking about. And a Flygon. But that full art Houndoom, though, I'm liking these these cards they have in replace of the. It's like the Amazing Rares from from Vivid Voltage, but these are way cooler than the Amazing Rares. All right, Fire Energy, give me a chance. Kimio's Cheers, Marnie's Pride, Grottle, Rio Lu, Starly, Spiritu, Purloin, Mercury, Alucha, and Clean Clang, Clean Clang, Clang, not holographic. We got two more packs here. We got an Arceus and a Charizard artwork. I gotta save the Charizard for last on this one. I'm going to keep it in there so I don't mess it up this time. Bear Tick. Fracture. Tropius. Turtwig. Trap Inch. Hipluck. Shroomish. Curloin. Luxio Reverse. And Tornadus. Alright guys. It's the moment of truth. Last pack of magic. Let's see what we got here. Dark Energy, Starvia, Monferno, Gloria, Purloin, Duskull, Sneasel, Cornfish, Magmar, and Alchemy Full Art for the Blast Pack Magic. And let's see what the last card is. Ah, oh, it's a Manaphy non holographic, but we got that Alchemy Full Art. And I will take that all day long for that last pack magic. Alright guys, so these are the pulls for this half of the box. If you didn't watch the first half, go watch that now. And let me know what you guys think. Thank you guys so much. See you later.